What is up, everyone in the Ripple and XRP community? Welcome back. Ripple Van Winkle is back with another exciting action-packed, jam-packed thriller of a video. Listen, in this episode, we got a lot to go over. We don't have a lot of time. I'm going to run you through all of these amazing headlines. Check this out. We're going to be talking about a new Ripple partnership. Yes, you heard that correctly. A new Ripple partnership. We're also going to be speaking about NFTs on the XRP ledger and when I think they are actually coming to life because I think it's soon. Yes, you heard that from me. Just remember what I said because when it happens, you're going to be like, well, Ripple Van Winkle told us this. SEC versus Ripple. We got an update. A massive brawl has broken out. And then how about the Lux Lions Metaverse? Whitelist spots, whitelist opportunities are coming. They are coming soon. I've been telling you, you want to get over to the Discord. You want to be part of this project. There's not going to be many whitelist spots. I want you to think about one thing right now and one thing only. When Sandbox first came out with their Metaverse, their, their pieces of land, their parcels, their Metaverse experience was selling for 50 bucks. It is now like four to $5,000. The company who I have decided to build my metaverse out on for the Lux Lines NFTs is the co-creator of Deadpool 2. Yes, you heard me correctly. The co-creator of Deadpool 2. We made a deal. We did a bunch of meetings. We signed a bunch of NDAs. We both came to agreements. We are building with them on one of the most unbelievable, realistic platforms out there unreal engine 5 the graphics are through the roof we are going to have an amazing and amazing island that's going to be fully customizable to my likings so that whitelist will be out soon you want to be part of the whitelist i am telling you because you're never going to get those prices that i am offering to the loyal members of the lux lions community now if you are not following any of the socials what i want you to do is i want you to look on top of the YouTube video right now. You will see the Twitter, YouTube, and my website. I want you to follow each and every one of them. I want you to click the bell and subscribe to this channel. We are then gonna head over to Live Coin Watch. And as I'm doing this video, I need to keep one eye on my dog because I made a, a rookie mistake of being a dog owner and leaving his cone off as I'm doing this video. He's a smart man. I have a feeling he's gonna be licking that leg. But Bitcoin. It's coming in at $20,624. Not much has changed since this morning. XRP is $0.32. Cents. Total cryptocurrency market cap $935 billion. Now, I'm going to show you this clip because this is how to get whitelisted on an NFT project. Watch this. That's how you have to, what you need to do to get whitelisted on most projects, folks. Not for me. Very simple. You come over to the Discord, you join up, you sign up, you start interacting with the community. It's your lucky day. Whitelist opportunity goes out. You'll be the first to know about it. You get yourself on it. And we are not doing any kind of limits. Listen, you want to buy three pieces of land? Go ahead, buy three pieces of land. No one is stopping you. You want to talk passive income on these metaverse projects? That's how you do it. You buy different lands. You open businesses in the metaverse. You open galleries. You start selling your goods. It is your land. Just like the real, real world, you can do what you please, folks. You can resell your land as well. Because when my island sells out a plot, there's no more plots left. What do you think happens to the value? It goes up. Think about this for a second. Here's the Lux Lions website. Remember, this is my NFT project, luxlionsnft.com. Look at this oasis. Look at these beautiful, beautiful NFTs, folks. All the links are in the description. Don't be shy. Get on over there. Now, Michael Crypto puts this out. And this is very interesting. It says, this is the use case for central bank digital currencies for F. 
X transactions. Interesting, right? What do we see here? We see a smart contract, bank A and bank B. We didn't see the transfer of currencies going through different central bank digital currency ledgers and shooting out to the correspondent central bank. Why does this look familiar? Why does this sound familiar? I'll tell you why it looks and sounds familiar because we've seen diagrams just like this when XRP is involved. Folks, the chicken and the egg problem was the hardest problem to solve according to David Schwartz. How did people get money onto the blockchain? It is that simple now they get into the stable coin of that country. The US is gonna have a stable coin, don't be confused about it. Uh, Euro, Mexico, Australia, Japan, they will all have stable coins. Those are your on and off ramps. Central bank digital currencies and XRP are going to be the bridge. Write it down, mark my words. Now this is a little throwback. So the Ripple did it, congratulations everyone. Congrats to all the long-term holders. XRP was positioned to be the bridge asset to rule them all 40 to 50 central banks let's go that is a massive number we know about three of them i am just waiting for india to be announced because i believe i do firmly believe that india will be the trickle down effect now we get this black fridge not black rock you heard me correctly black fridge has launched a great british pound <coughs> Excuse me, stable coin. This is what I'm talking about. Great British pound stable coin. That's going to be an on and off ramp. XRP is going to be a bridge. You take the great British pound stable coin, you take it to a Mexican peso stable coin. Bada beam, bada boom. XRP connects them, bridges it out both sides, free up those Nostra Volstra accounts between those two. And what do you got? Instant settlement with no friction. Here's the article from Finaxtra. This came out three hours ago not going to read it to you but you can see the official press release for it then my man james rule put this out and this is big news as well and before i get into this i'm telling you right now write it down put it on your fridge ripple van winkle says august is when nfts go live on the xrp ledger we are seeing more and more of the votes go go through august is the date i am looking at it's not far away it is july 11th so james puts this out cross tower partner with ripple to support nfts minted on the xrp ledger cross tower will facilitate minting and trading of nfts with ripple as blockchain partners providing technical support on the xrp ledger cross towers marketplace makes it easy for developers and creatives to onboard their project accelerating time to market and that's the biggest thing, right? Accelerating time to market. It states, and this is from the CEO of Cross Tower, we are thrilled to partner with Ripple and build our web 3.0 platform on the XRP ledger. Ripple's commitment to building a developer network in India is particularly exciting for Cross Tower as we are committed to developing India's blockchain talent. We look forward to the growth of our global NFT platform. Folks, there it is again india once again i am telling you india ripple it's seal it's locked that whole country is going to run via the ledger remember that and remember xrp nfts august then michael about five links puts this out let's talk about the ripple versus sec lawsuit let's talk about talk about the brawl that is currently going down SEC wants to seal information in reference to five of its experts to put Ripple in a difficult position. So all this is going on. The SEC is delaying. We have no room for the judge on the Hinman emails, even though she's already ruled three previous times that Ripple should be getting the emails. She gave them a fourth chance. She didn't give them a rebuttal to get it, and yet we have nothing. And now this comes out, and James K. Finally puts it out. Breaking news. This came out 10 o'clock last night, folks. Defendants and SEC in brawl over expert reports. The SEC is taking the extreme position that the names of experts and any substantive criticism of their reports should be kept from public view. Expediting briefing request. Here it is. It says, the report of expert five, including his name and affiliation, has already been filed on the public record by the SEC. The SEC nevertheless insists the defendants redact even expert five's name and any identifying information from the, Dal the Dalbright motion. Then it states, expert one 
does not support the extraordinary relief the SEC seeks even as to expert loan, let alone to other experts. The SEC's attempt to shield the identities and opinions of its experts from any public scrutiny is both unprecedented and unsupported by any evidence of need. To the right of the public to have access to these materials will be critical to the court's upcoming rulings on the party's Dobright motions. The substantial presumptions of public access is strongest, whereas materials filed with the courts to merits. So what do they want? They want to seal five expert witnesses' names, identities, because they feel like it's not needed because they're going to get public scrutiny. Ripple's like, throw them out there, put them on blast. You have to be kidding me. This is where we are right now. And yet what's lingering, what's hanging above the head right here? I'll tell you. Simple. The judge's decision on those Hinman emails. Where are the Hinman emails? That's what I want to know. That's what everyone wants to know. We need these emails, folks. I'm telling you, these emails are going to be the nail in the coffin. They are going to be what ends this lawsuit. They are going to bring fireworks once we truly find out the corruption, the lies, the manipulation that is going on behind the scenes. Because we know there's a lot of it and we have un covered a lot of it that's where i'm gonna leave this video i gotta go talk metaverse i gotta go figure everything out final details whitelist let's do it wash your damn hands be nice and be kind of each other ripple van winkle is out